hi tps welcome back to my next video in jn2 labs so in this video we are going to see about wordpress a complete video complete tutorial in your own language in indian english language where i will be using hindi and telugu some parts of hindi some parts of telugu while playing with exam and we will make one project in php also if everything goes well then we will make a video on php where we will be discussing how to do the stuff and how to web develop a website and in this video we are going to see only wordpress so wordpress how to develop it how to use Word wordpress i'll be using wordpress only using i'll be using wordpress in this video as you can able to see the title with the title you will be understanding that the, how to use wordpress that is the only main intention of this video how to use the wordpress okay we will be not be developing any plugins or any themes or any themes development but just we will be using the wordpress plugin wordpress software or you can tell it anything wordpress tool or wordpress cms content management system anything you what you like so we will be using this wordpress so i will be not be using in my server yeah the i'll be using in my local host how to run that local host and this a small part of video about 5 to 6 minutes or 10 minutes will be useful for php development as well as a wordpress development let us know how wordpress is developed it is basically developed by using php so basically all the modules all the themes which are developed in the wordpress is all about you can able to see the plugins so here is the plugins and here are the themes is all themes and plugins this all are developed using php languages so all these are developed using php so all these are developed using php languages there are lot of videos in youtube you'll be finding how to develop a theme or how to develop a plugin basically i am building this content for jntu university people jntu hyderabad people because you csc and it people you can start building money start earning money by the day one of your college join or from the second year of your college join if you practically attend the workshops and everything so without wasting time let us see how what are the things required to install the wordpress and what are the things uh, how to install the wordpress in our local host okay so basically you need an exam in this exam you will be you require seven this versions any version and basically you can able to see these all are of 64 bits yes these all are of 64 bits there is no 32 bit version in this you can't able to find there is no 34 bit it is supported by wordpress which is a blog joomla content management system which is cms made simple drupal these all things wikimedia media wiki nothing but pista shop or e-commerce this is a move this is all predefined modules can be installed in this wordpress in this exam sorry not wordpress in this exam so basically you need to download it i have already downloaded it here it is you can able to see just double click it and just you need to inst install it of you i will be showing you before installation and after installation how it, the thing is okay so here it is asking me a permission so let me give you a permission yes and let me go to my c drive i go to my c drive right this is my c drive you can able to see an exam from here so when i am did require it basically it was my previous exam which i basically have deleted it everything now let us check what happened to this exam what happened to this exam let me install it see installation page has been begun important click okay no problem no worries set up click on next leave this all things as it is click on next a folder will be created in an exam it's okay let us go for next let us go for next okay now installation has been processed see what is happening in the back end please close it we have already installed it no yeah i want to stop this installation because my installation is already is done doing in the main day it get installed let me show you the wordpress hello let us extract here you will find some delays you can be patient you can sit relax you will be understanding full video no problem it will may it might be taking one hour but it is a full install a wordpress and how to develop a website from a to z you are seeing this video and also you are practicing 
then uh, my recommendation is you pause this video don't pause this video every time you go you go ahead and do simultaneously side by side what i do because i take some time because i don't skip any i don't cut the video or don't fast i did i don't fast for the forward the video the only thing is just i amplify the video with which i am right now recording okay so it takes some time i know wordpress takes some time and the setup is also taking some time let me pause the video for a meanwhile and let me again start the video it takes some long time so here you can able to see wordpress is about to finish the process and here we got our wordpress folder which is this kind of thing so what i will do firstly i will rename it to wp a revert wordpress okay so exam is still installing it is getting installed so what i will do again i will pause the video for few minutes okay friends okay friends you can able to see that it is slowly unpacking the files and we are about to install already it has been installed about to finish which i meant to tell you now the time is night 8:30 indian standard time making this video for you till 9 about half an hour i will be making it more half an hour in this 40 session 40 minutes of video you will be getting to know yes i have learned something in by this video ha ah, still it is installing till then what i can able to do for you is let me show you the folder which it has created already and this is the folder where you will be going in your c drive you will be going your exam where which we where we will be playing is uh, ht docs all the thing all the things we will be playing in this ht docs folder so let me copy wp folder in this ht docs folder right now okay so it has been moved successfully and creating an un an so now after installing exam whether it has installed properly or not how to check i am closing this because we don't want any more and if you want to download that exam wordpress i will be providing the link in the description no worries you can able to go click that and download the latest version i know i am making it in 2019 but you will be see uh, in 2015 2019 right so you can may see this watch this video in 2020 as well whenever you watch to to download a wordpress and the process will be the same almost same installation process this is a basic installation process which is so basically problem due to only the configuration of the system which you are using here i am using a dos system asus asus system it takes some time no problem for me i am okay with it so here you go with your mozilla so basically you need to have a mozilla it's better or else if you are using your local ho your mozilla it's better or else if you are using your local ho your chrome then well and but basically i prefer to you use only mozilla firefox so do you want to start the control panel now yes i want to start it and it's an open so that the reason and the installation has been finished right now we can check whether everything is working perfectly or not i am saving it the language it's an english language i want to do right and a control box or a dialog box will be open or a panel exam panel which we call it will be open this is the exam panel studio apache okay apache is good for only php if you are using a backend like sql this kind of thing then you need to use this also basically wordpress is all about the database it manages the database perfectly so that's the reason we require an sql so here you go start at sql now what i'll do go for a local go for a local host okay just type local host that's it nothing else i think much we need to do go for the php my admin okay if it if it is too fast then please slow down the video you have an option in the settings in the video you will find a settings box there you can click it and you can slow it down or you can fast forward the video it's all about you go for click for new create a database name here i want to use wp set it set as it is whatever it is okay just create it it will create automatically don't create any table or nothing you need to do now what we need to do we need to access our wordpress file okay we need to develop a wordpress site right so what i'll do local host let me go to wp that's it after local host if you are typing the wp it will be taking us to this wp folder 
basically in this wp folder everything configuration first time configuration will be done, done available here so those configurations now it up so it is asking me a language english is okay for me being a joint if students english is comfortable let's go uh, he is asking what's the database name right now we have created with wp username username is root basically everything is it is caps right r o o t root basically password it doesn't have we have after installation and database host local host prefix this all are same okay you these two things you need to do we database name you need to before before that you need to configure your database you need to create your database i have shown you how to create it then you need to give whatever name you will be giving it here here whatever name you will be giving give the same name here that's it then click on submit it will take a half a minute to get installed okay run the installation it require a title give a title like we'll make a what we will, okay or else what i'll do for you we'll make j and t u softwares download okay whatever the jntu students jntu student student software download jntu lab jntu lab software download not students jntu lab software download give anything username like jntu labs labs okay password anything admin at the rate 1 2 3 Four. Give A S caps. Don't give one two three four. Give it one four seven. Don't give caps A D M at the rate one four seven. Right two five eight. Let let it be weak. No problem. Admin one zero one two three four. That's it. Confirm to use the weak password. Give anything any mail ID. Admin I have email ID. Admin at the rate by dvd grabber dot com. Discourage search engine from indexing my site. You don't click it. Okay, digrabber. dot com. Discourage search engine from indexing my site. You don't click it. Okay, never you do it. Otherwise, your search engine, Google search engine will not able to find your website. Then click on install. That's the only thing. You save it because we will be working on it. So right now, I have saved it. It will take about thirty seconds to get installed. Once it is done, let us see how it all looks like. After installation. you will not find any plugins here basically it doesn't support the site is experiencing some technical difficulties it seems let us reload it just go and log in right here it is it just click login here you go with your dashboard and this is a simple way to get install the software in your local host and what you can do is you can visit your website to visit your website you just you type wp that's it in front of you here you go with okay so basically here you have pages and here you have posts and here you have theme if you go and add new theme you will be finding a bunch of themes here so you can browse them you can browse you have latest themes here so download let us see something on download kind of thing so download related themes let us find out here you go just install it next you activate it now the theme which you are seeing here will automatically changes and it will become the theme which you have seen so you have your software this kind of thing since there is nothing to show that's the reason it's empty if you see the all posts then you will be finding posts and if you add any theme you can able to see this kind of thing begin i recommend you to begin start beginning that install those files because that theme require this all plugins to be installed so this is how we can install at a time of all the video all the plugins i have three plugins you can able to see there are three plugins out of them one is getting installed is installed successfully next is getting installed and the third one it will be getting installed right so basically three things this theme wants to use so we need to install it because it requires we need to give it by giving by installing these plugins it will be make our website more user friendly and it will work functional function as per the theme re need to work function shall sure, so let us see see a sweet you can able to see that there is a small round color kind of thing you have received got is a blog no problem everything getting installed and activation is in the process so basically now what i'll do i'll have searched the theme and installed one theme and i have shown you how this theme is working and all and let me check show you some essential 
WordPress plugins and how to use them and how to write the content and everything. Let us so let us let us so let us go for a dashboard. Let us see the posts. Any post we have. No post. One post which we have we have thrown in trash. And let us go to plugins. Add new plugin. In this, you need to search for download. How to see whether the plugin with which you are you which you want is perfect one or not? Let me show you the screenshot of this. You need to always see the screenshot where see you have your download. Add new. You'll be adding these all things. You'll add it free download. See you have your free download. This is your front view. This is a short code. Super. Okay, download now. You have see version, file size, everything you have, and download. For me, it's a good kind of thing. Let us install the WordPress download manager to get it download. Just click on install now button. It will install. Let us get something about exam because we'll make two post. One is for exam. One is for your WordPress. One is for your WordPress. Here you need to then activate it once installed. I hope that two are open and there are something here. There are something other plugins. If you want them, you can install. Or else, go to downloads. Click on add new. Here you need to add your file name. Basically, my file is nothing but you can close these all things. Just minimize it. Here is my file name. Basically, is the thing exam for Windows and it is 64 bit. And the version is right. So what I will do, I will copy some content from here. Exam. Let me write it here. Is select the file. Go to desktop. Me select the file. Click on open. Here it is recommending for 2 MB. So what I will do, I will go to. I will save this draft. Save as draft. Okay. I will save it as a draft. Then what I will do, I will go to first settings and I will increase this 2 MB or else it's very difficult. If it is like more press. Maximum file size is 125 file size, which it can accept for an upload. So here is the download speed where you can check it. See here you have the server file, direct the IP addresses which you want to block. If you want to use the CAPTCHA because someone want to, if you want them to use this CAPTCHA and then afterwards to get download, then you can do it. Let us go for an interface. Any update? No, is it right? Asset manager. You have your draft. It. Let us go for browse. No browse. The URL. I will insert one URL of download link of any one of them. Let me copy link location. Right. Add it. Done. And let me. What I'll do. That will be an easy part for me. Add on applications. I'll copy from here. And here you go with that. Okay. Done. I can have field and value name. So let me give a field like version. And value is like this is the value version. I don't want to give any comment. I'm tracking back. So so any custom fields you require is asking. No, I don't want. Basically, this is the version. Basically, the version is this is the version. file size. Those D one forty six MB. <laughs> It's a large file. Stock limit. View count. Download count. Visitor. All they don't want. Let us publish it. Okay. It got published. Let me check here. Is anything available in our website? Right now, it's not available, but it's available here. Here you can able to see that stock is infinity file type created date, and here you go with your download. Right, and if you want to add an image of it, you can add it here. Here is a small description of it. It looks like good. You have this title, and you can customize this page. So this is how we can able to view this post, and we can add as much post as possible. And okay, so these are the small plugins. And if you go with as much of plugins, you can see how many plugins we have. This is a small download kind of thing. So where, so where you can able to see, you can basically click out here. The file will get. It will be redirecting that link, and then it will be saying that save that file. Basically, the thing it does is the same thing. Okay, so basically, you have as many as popular plugins you have. WordPress can't do this kind this kind of things. Everything. So that's the reason we need to build it in this manner. So you have your Yoast for search engine SEO. We have already installed the content contact form seven and WooCommerce for the e-commerce website. If you want to develop a e-commerce website, then this is the Most trusted pl plugin, about five million plus downloads. You have this is a firewall kind of thing. You can have your simple CSS, which will be helpful if your website doesn't have an HTTP lock here. Then you can use this 
a simple really simple C. then it will be helpful for you if you want an exam xml then you can have it if you want to link with your google analytics of you can use it right one super catchy for to remove your catches and many more you have if i explain lot one by one then it will be taking a lot of time so let us go for a customization here and let me explain about this customization technique and basically all the things here you have is your pages pages are nothing but if you see a website let me show you some website like ydgrabber.com it is my website if you see this website we are having some home page about us page contacts contacts contact us page some pages you will be having those are nothing but your pages these are nothing but your pages when you have a blog means your articles need to be written then you will be writing your post small thing the difference between the post and article is the post are nothing but your articles which you are writing every day day by day day by day day by day and your this home this hindi songs lyrics punjabi this this the, these all are your what i tell is these all things is nothing but your posts not post pages these all are nothing but your pages okay and this is your like post if you see this is one of the post in this website this is one of the post simple post okay and remaining these things are like your pages these all are like pages if you want to that will show your category of telugu this one page this one page okay so these all are pages and those are post hope you understood about this pages and posts and remaining thing are very simple let us see for customization there are no bunch of customization here you can have your logo just another web- website here you have this so that is the thing or you can upload your image your logo okay you can you can add site favicon favicon is nothing but your this kind of this is nothing but your favicon you can add it here okay every theme has its own identity and own settings okay so here you have menu you can keep it left or you can keep it menu you can keep it left or you can keep it right here it will be showing logo position sorry here i want to show my logo or not header fixed or not header is fixed if i keep it as fixed and the header will be fixed this is my header it is fixed this is the header and this is the thing logo it will be fixed okay so that is the thing block settings block style there are different different styles so we do, we don't have much content in that so that's the reason if i want a sidebar or not left right sidebar or left sidebar in my blog then i can set it here here also a single sidebar preloader preloader is on you can able to see a round round kind of thing so that is the preloader header image you can give an image to a header because of background home page setting static page if i use then you can able to convert your website add new page page title is home add it here you can have your home okay your home page doesn't got anything that's the reason your styling you can add your colors to your theme you can have your own fonts then you can add your menu this is the visit area where in your footer area 1 2 3 you can add your footer let me add something to you and let me show to you i'll add a calendar for you so you got your calendar here is a footer section is a footer 2 you can add something else anything you can add this is the image i want to delete there is nothing image in this website so add add what i can add is search okay search i can add search so there is a search bar right here footer area add site origin button i need to have configured this all thing so this is how we can add this footer widgets footer widgets of footer so that was my widgets okay footer widgets no problem now let me go to footer here i can add my social accounts facebook and everything here all many 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 for social, social accounts very so on footer widget area hide or show how many columns i need to show it's asking then again you have any copyright style see you have here copyright style right this kind of thing i have a style too then you will be finding there is something else this is how it will looks and if i give add red hds then you will be able to see here hds for at the red hds this is how this footer area works and additional any css if you are pretty sure that yes i know coding of css then you can go ahead with this content okay this is a small thing which we have then you need to go and head up publish and you can get start with this wordpress so this is how you can start with your wordpress and it differs from theme to theme my theme i got this 
your theme it may differ okay so by theme to theme it get differ see now here I have a smooth calendar search bar and what is this oh no I have what I have what I have given there so this is how it looks like here you have version you can add an image kind of thing and then you can have a download kind of thing everything you see it automatically detects the file size also and it is able to tell us the plugin was very good cool plugin uh, I can use somewhere else at some point of time if I get something this kind of thing right so this is how I can able to get use of WordPress and you have many more plugins use it use as most as you can and then you can develop a cool website and in my later videos I will be telling you how to develop a website if I get a something like content and everything is a, the a perfect theme with a perfect theme with a perfect plugins everything I will note it down and then I'll make a video for you for developing a WordPress website okay so till then stay tuned to my channel and if you have any doubts or queries you can always feel free to contact me comment below you can get as fast as possible till then goodbye thank you and if my